We start with a tragic end to a family vacation. An extended family gathered at a cabin for the 4th of July week in Wisconsin. The Juneau County Sheriff says six people, including three children, died in a fire that broke out early Sunday. Eric Shula joins us to explain how a southern Minnesota community is helping support the survivors. Eric. Yeah, Kevin and Leah, the principal of Minnesota Valley Lutheran High School told me they're ready to support Pastor Steve Keel, who lost his wife and five-year-old daughter in the fire. See, the family had just bought a home in New Ulm and the plaster, pastor rather planned to move there and teach there in the fall. The six victims are being remembered by their extended church family. The whole sky was orange. The sky glowed, according to neighbor Ken Zielinski, early Sunday. The flames at that point, which happened really quick, uh, were almost above the jack pines. So it's 20, 25 feet. A fire took the lives of six family members staying together at a vacation rental for the 4th of July week in Juneau County, Wisconsin. We found out that granddaughters were still in the house, that they hadn't uh, made it out. And then he ran in with, with one of his daughters to see if they could um, do anything to save them, and then they never made it out themselves. Close friend Larry Schlomer says Pastor Steve Witte lost his life while trying to go back in and save his family in the fire. Always, always ready to, to do whatever it took to, to serve other people. Friends say Pastor Witte's daughter, Karis Keel, and her five-year-old daughter, Stella, died in the fire. Karis and her husband, Pastor Steve Keel, had just made plans to move to New Ulm. Her husband had accepted a call to teach at Minnesota Valley Lutheran High School. Friends of the couple shared a statement that reads in part, we love the Keel family, Jesus loves them more, and now they are with him forever. That family was very active in the church. And now the community of the Wisconsin Evangelical Lutheran Synod, guided by their faith, will support the survivors and remember the six victims. We know that, that, that one day we will see him again uh, along with all, all of those family members. As for the cause of the fire, the Juneau County Sheriff says it appears to be accidental but remains under investigation. Meanwhile, there is a fundraising effort to help Pastor Keel and his two children make the move from Minnesota to Ohio. We put a link to it on the Featured on 5 tab at KSDP.com. Kevin. Thank you, Eric.